Hi all, and uh, yeah, welcome to this immensely cool unboxing. And yeah, um, <coughs> sorry about that, my voice is a little bit uh, off today, so I might be coughing a little bit. So uh, yeah. <coughs> no, well, let's get right down to it, shall we? And here it is. This is the unboxing. We're going to unbox a set of uh, digital optical cables. <laughs> no, we're not. But uh, yeah, these are just extras. But, <laughs> yeah, as, as uh, the title said, it's an amazing big unboxing. Oh my god, it's going to be huge. And it actually is going to be quite huge because we are going to unbox... Uh, let me see here if I can get that on right oh. The Logitech Z906 Spore Surround Sound System. Oh, hell yeah, baby. Let's just get our trusty knife out here. Our, uh, not the normal one that you're used to, but uh, our new trusty knife right here <laughs> there's this beast back that's holder all right let's do it there we go hey okay. of course ah! please would you please That actually sounds cool. <laughs> okay. And I just put it proper in and out of again. There we go. You actually need a permit for having an out knife like that. Okay. First thing first. The manual, but this is an ordinary manual. Look at how thick that beast is. <laughs> God damn. Okay. Now we have to get out of stand here. Yeah. Go. Yeah, uh, Logitech has made it so that you actually. Here, can probably show it on the other side here. Here, there's a little holder right there, and you pick up the entire subwoofer. I placed the subwoofer on my chair, and <coughs> anyway, you go. Uh, cool. Here we have the subwoofer. Right here, this big piece. Damn, this thing is. <coughs> Sorry about that, I told you, I had something in my throat. Damn, this thing is huge! Uh, oh. uh, there's nothing else, cool. Okay, just for comparison, right? Uh, let me see, a little comparison here. This is how big this subwoofer is, right? This stupid little thing is my old subwoofer. As you can see, first of all, that's the little subwoofer. You can hear it. Something <laughs> that's gone loose inside it, but yeah. This is the old subwoofer. I don't give a shit. And this beast of a subwoofer is the new one. Oh, good crap. Oh my god, I just did my pants. Oh my god, look at this beast. Look at this beast. Oh my goodness. 
Look at it. Oh, me oh, crap. Oh, my goodness. And look at the back. Look at the back. Look at that. Look at that awesomeness right there. Look at that awesomeness. These are for the, uh, the satellites, these small speakers. But look at this beast. Holy crap. Look at a woofer hole. <laughs> Place this right here. And now for the satellites themselves. Hoi! 5.1 meaning there is five satellites and one subwoofer remote control let us see here what center speaker right there Look at that, it's a beast looking. There's the little feet. Damn, it's a robbery. Yeah, so it doesn't uh, skits and stuff like that. And look at this. Oh, sorry. The same uh, setup system as the subwoofer. Oh my god. The front, this has got to be the front left speaker. Again. <clears throat> but this one stands up like this because you have the feet down there at the bottom cool but you can put it up on the wall with that little thing there I think there is to put it up on the wall front right speaker same as the other ones Rear left speaker. Nothing there, same as the others. Uh, rear right speaker. Same as the others. Okay. Speaker wires, all the speaker wires you'll ever need. Pretty cool. And here comes my favorite. Um, yeah. Let me see if I can do it with this one. <laughs> Gotta be careful not to. Oh, yeah, perfect. There you go, got rid of this little yeah, piece of plastic. There we go. Ah, the center control box right here. That one too. Got the volume button. Got all manner of buttons, but I will go into a little bit more depth, in depth detail a little later on. And it has this kind of st uh, jack in order to connect it to the subwoofer. So yeah, that was the control. Pretty damn cool thing, if I could say so myself. Uh, this here is the normal uh, audio stick that you would place into uh, the computer and stuff like that. We're not going to need it. More speaker cable. More speaker cable, more speaker cable, and last but not least, because it is a beast of a system, batteries for the remote control. Okay, I 
I'm just going to take uh, this bad boy right here. It has its own power cable. Oh, oh, oh my god. And place it right here. Ah. Right here, come down. Ah. And have a chat with you guys. <laughs> nope. First of all, I'm going to need a cup of coffee. Oh, that's a good cup of you. Okay, let me see here. There's two. Oh, I can't see it. There's two big cables. <coughs> Those are for the rear speakers. Then there is ah two. Yeah, two medium and a small one. So yeah. And they all look like this. Pretty standard uh, speaker cable. But this here is even better than what came with the other system I had. So yeah. <clears throat> Away with you. Let's have a look at our little friend here, the remote control. Away with you. There, thank you. There we have it, the remote control. We got our off button right there. Let me see if we can get it into focus here. Would you please get into focus? Would you? No, apparently not. Well, uh, input and mute button right over there. So, uh, on off, input and mute. And then we have the um, up and down volume, level and effect, that's something else uh, you can do with it, I think. Oh. Opening the back to get in the small three triple A's. Yeah. Get back here. This little piggy went to market. Got to get in there. This little piggy stayed home. This little piggy went to dinner. And a big wet wolf. Stoot them all. Okay, yeah, there's no uh, indication when you turn it on and off on this uh, thingy here. There's no little LED light or something like that that shines up when you click it. So. Uh, oh, <clears throat> I just saw something extra on here. There's actually a microphone and ear earport jack for this one. Dolby. So yeah, got your power switch down there. Um, ah, level. Okay, level mode. You can see this little grid right here. This here is the 5.1 five point, uh, 5 .1 surround sound setup. As you can see, there are uh, like the center right there, two left and right uh, front, uh, right left and right rear, and the subwoofer over here. And right underneath it, you will have uh, this little level control, so you can probably set it to say, I only want the three on top at the subwoofer running, or only the three on top, or only the four and a subwoofer, or only the single center and a subwoofer. I think it's something like that. And over here on this side, um, we have inputs. Holy oh, crap, we got inputs. We got 3D stereo, 4 1 or 2 uh, or 1. So, yeah. Dang, I just think I do some cool ass things. But, yeah, I will. Um, <coughs> I will set it up and I will use my, um, yeah, I will use my iPhone to show you how it looks. I don't have it at the moment, so uh, I guess I'm going to have to find it. <coughs> so, yeah, but that's not going to be in a, that's not gonna be in a separate video. I'm just going to record it with my iPhone, take it onto the computer and splice them together. So, yeah, see you in a bit and you will see how it looks. All fully set up. And here we go. It's finally set up. Just you can see the center one right down there, the one on the right, and the one on the left. 
no, sorry. Uh, yeah, left, right. And then up behind here, we got one of the one of these satellite, and the other satellite is up there. And the BST subwoofer down there. <coughs> and of course, the controller between the two screens. Oh yeah. <coughs> now I know what these over here are for. This is actually input because on my computer I have this to control it. As you can see down here, we got the analog, the normal type dealio, uh, like the cable that I just um, <laughs> that I threw away. I told you we're not going to use that, and the digital one. And an automatic uh, went up here and said, we're going to use this one, the digital output thingy right here. Come on, come on. There we go. Optical, the digital output optical. Yeah, that's the one that it's using. So, on the subwoofer down here, <coughs> um, there is uh, this, uh, uh, I don't know if you can see it here. No, there was these, um, uh, both those and some other, uh, some other types. And of course the optical right there. But the optical was a number three input. So on the controller here, you have to set it to number three right down there. So it knows, ah, it's input number three. Cool. And now I got a page here from my system here full of music. Uh, probably can't play much. Um, uh, one here that might not be able to. Yo, for the fan. Yeah, pretty nice, huh? Pretty damn decent bass. Oh wait a minute! I think I could do something here. I think I have some music that is allowed for me to play to you. I got it. There we go. This here is free music from uh, uh, YouTube. So let's see here. Yeah, there we have it. Uh, this has been my uh, unboxing and install of the uh, Logitech Z906. Uh, if you want more information about it, a link will be in the description below. And as always, thank you all so very much for watching. And catch on the flip side. Thank you.